Welcome back to Deus Ex Invisible War. We've arrived at Cairo. We've got a mission from the WTO. They say it's still not too late to help them out, but of course I'm not going to do it. They want me to, I think, destroy Dr. Nassif's uncle's greenhouse? Yeah, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> we have a, a quest from the Order. They want me to speak with Billy in the mosque, but unfortunately... The way to the mosque seems to be locked, even though I could obviously blatantly fit through this. I can't, and I can't seem to open it, and I just realized there's a button. There's a button. That is a weird place for a button. Wow. That is so easy to miss. Never mind, the way to the mosque is not blocked at all. Uh, hmm. Let's go a different way, though. That's, that's the main quest. Let's do the side quest. We do have a side quest to help out Queequeg's coffee. They want NG... Is it just NG? Yeah. Just NG. I don't, I don't even know what NG stands for. But they want me to speak with NG's manager at Arcology. And bribe them to become the new spokesperson. Or like, advertise for Queequeg or be their spokesperson or something. Oh, greenhouse is that way too. Yeah, here's Arcology. What is Arcology? Like apartment buildings or? God, this is such a depressing place. It's so grim. Wait a second. Hey, what are you up to? You're not making my job any easier. Just hold on. I just want to look at the picture, okay? Photo of SSC guard's husband is what it's described as. That is a very strange picture. Really strange. There's some weird perspective stuff going on, or it's been squashed or something. However, I am extremely surprised and pleased to see that this is the second photo I've ever seen. Every other picture frame has had that one weird photo of, like, the orb. Finally something what new. The hell? Look, I put it back in your desk. Chill. Arcology miniature. I'm gonna have to order you to take a hike. I have to see your arcology pass before I can let you in. I don't have one. How do I get one? If you don't already have one, then you're probably not supposed to have one. But there might be a compromise. Such as? There are those in the Medina who might get you a pass for a price, but really all they're looking for are mercenaries to do their dirty work. Me? I just want to help people out. Give me a few credits for my trouble, and I'll act like you've got a pass. Yeah, sure. It's a deal. Here's your money. Okay, you're clear to enter. Come to work in the Arcology. Fusing architecture and ecology, these WTO-constructed cities provide easy pedestrian access to all work, living, and recreational spaces inside the safety of our atmospheric barriers. None of the waste, sprawl, and inconvenience of pre-collapse urban spaces. All the convenience and luxury you deserve. Get your work pass and start your future today. So it's an entirely self-contained living space? That, uh, I assume is shaped like a pyramid, given that this has Arcology Miniature and it looks like a pyramid? Uh, let's not do that. Oh, oh my god. What the hell's wrong with this elevator? It must be magic that allows this rust to move. Um, also, there's a little gap in between <laughs> the elevator there where you can see the wall. Only on that side, though. It's not on this side. Two multi-tools required just to go there. It looks like it's kind of a timed thing though, right? Like, I could probably get through? Maybe? Maybe. I wonder if it's instant death or just damage. City map Cairo Arcology. Let's take a look at that. 
Level 107, 108. Oh, right. And someone else drew us a map for Medina. Templar Recruiting Station, Gifted School, Pequot's Coffee Shop, Nanoformer Station, Ordered Church. Wow, there's a lot here. It is a self-enclosed living space. Makes sense. Corporate Suites. Ooh, probably good stuff in there. Arcology Concourse. Well, we're supposed to see Billy, who's now with the Order, so I was hoping we need to go to the Order Church elevator. Nanoformer programming. Uh, let's go to the Order Church first. This is a maintenance area. Limited access. Let's not go that way. get an actual view of Cairo. Can you imagine how imposing and bizarre the arcology looks from the perspective of people out in that city? I mean, look how high up we are compared to it. This is just a towering pyramid that you could see from practically everywhere. That's just weird. Templar recruiting. Tarsus. Wait a minute, there's a Tarsus Academy here? I didn't know there were multiple Tarsus Academies. That's where we escaped from originally. Is that on the map? Um, oh, it must be to Gifted School. Huh. That could be interesting. Here's the Order Church Elevator. Oh, thank god, this one's not rusty. I love the elevator music. The mosque is a weapons-free zone. To enter, you must submit to a deactivation procedure. Gotcha. Okay. Th WTO indifference to nanite pollution is the reason for the plague that has decimated the village. If you and Billy can help the locals, maybe you can win their trust and get some information on Dr. Nassif. I need to return in time for the summit. Just a show for the media. I'm not so sure. Her holiness sounded sincere when I spoke with her in Germany. A co-dominion with the WTO? Not in my lifetime. History moves in fits and starts. Obviously, you're too young to remember pre-collapse society. I watched two centuries of progress vanish during two minutes on the evening news. Destruction. That's easy. But Her Holiness and Chairman Dumier think they can reunify the planet with a simple decree. The faithless are easy to manipulate politically. And remember, the faithless are the majority. We should not forget de Tocqueville's insight. If a man does not submit to faith, he will desire a firm, tyrannical shape for society. It's not too late to reform the church. Perhaps I will find out when I get to Trier. Tell me about this epidemic. The air is full of toxic nanite debris. Decades old fallout from the collapse, they say. They keep dragging in more villagers. A pretty pitiful sight. What are we supposed to do? As far as I'm concerned, it's not our problem. Hyagur Chen said you were in charge of handling the epidemic. She told me to send you into the Medina, the village, to talk to the Omar in their hideout, 
Supposedly, they say that the WTO has technology to clean up the nanites, but won't use it. That's quite a claim. Well, apparently they can get you inside an arcology facility where there's proof. Personally, I'm not going to waste my time saving the planet until we figure out where Dr. Nassif is hiding. Hyoga Chen is a fine seeker. She has a strong heart. But a strong heart often runs contrary to a seeker's purpose. I don't believe we've met. Luminen Saman from the German Shard. My pleasure. I was hoping one of Billy's former classmates would show up. Do you think Dr. Nassif is still in Cairo? We have good reason to believe that Apostle Corps' headquarters are in Cairo. This is where she would go looking for help. Hey, I almost forgot. Here's something Chen wanted me to give you as a bonus for killing that Mako guy. Thanks. Just making the world safer. One mad scientist at a time. Right. Carry on, Alex. So what did we just get? It just said press V to install weapon mod. So I guess we got a weapon mod of some sort, but I don't know what kind. Oh, I think we received another refire rate. I think I had two before, and now I've got three. Either way, not something I want. Please tell me this breaks. Oh. Oh, it's made out of wood. This place is so... Land. Somehow they've made this, even this architecture, which is kind of cool. They somehow still made it look bland. Just all desaturated and gray. Oh, infirmary. Uh. How's it going? Plague 11 casualty. Unconscious. Well, at least they're not dead. Um, Doctor, you think maybe the plague victim casualty should be on the stretcher slash bed thing and maybe not laying on the ground? <laughs> well, this quiet area sign. It's like, QUIET AREA! He yells at you with loud red text. Maybe if they knew that I'm sick, they'd let me in. I wish it could be that way, baby. I guess I just wasn't smart enough. Nonsense. <coughs> Why won't they at least let us in the city? The air's not so bad inside the mosque. You'll start to feel better. Just get some rest and forget about Tarsus. It's a very selective program. Oh, they're hoping to get inside of Tarsus to save them from the plague. It's really odd, by the way, to see an actual child. This is the first child I've seen in the game, I'm pretty Boo. sure. Boo? Okay. Yeah, it's the first child I've seen in this game, and it's just really weird because I realized pretty far through playing Deus Ex Mankind Divided, which I played for like 40 hours, pretty far into that, I realized that there is not a single child. There are no children in that game at all. So I went a very long time without ever seeing a child, so it's really weird to see one in a Deus Ex game now. It's like, who are you? Mm. What? I don't mean to interrupt. You startled me there. I guess I'm a little preoccupied. What's wrong? Well, it's my daughter, Mina. Look at her. <coughs> Oh, it's okay, Mom. I'll get better. Ever since she didn't get into the Tarsus Academy, her infection has been getting worse. She should be up on level 107 right now, in her own dorm room, studying and breathing filtered air. She's always been such a good student. I wish there was something I could do. That's very kind. But unless you're on the admissions committee at the Academy, or unless you're someone who can hack in and put Mina Amir on the acceptance list, there's not really much to do except wait and pray. <laughs> really, Mom, I'll be fine. <laughs> Some of us still worship the old gods, despite everything that's happened. She wants into Tarsus, huh? I'll see what I can do. Hack. Hack them into the enrollment registry. I can do that. 
You look fine to me. Anything I can do to help? Just stay out of the way. Too many patients. No time for chit-chat. As you wish. I just stopped by to talk to a friend of mine, Billy Adams. She's working with the Order Church. The woman from Seattle, yes. Where are you from? New Cairo? Why come here? The air in the Medina is polluted. Is it that serious? Just take a look outside. It's nanite dust these people breathe, from nanite swell 11. Particles like little insects, unaffected by the wind. Probably a leak from a pre-collapsed laboratory that's been forgotten for two decades. Yuck. I guess it's an improvement. Oh, come on. Why does the kid scream every time I pick up the body? I'm just trying to put him in the bed. Go away now! Okay, yeah, they're not even touching the floor now. That's definitely an improvement. Stop! Do they hate me now? Oh, I don't feel good. Nah, we're good. I think it's time to leave. If you're ready to head out, just exit the area. Kitty cat. Hello. Christ, for a second I thought that was the cat. Where's the Omar that just said that? Oh. You okay, kitty? Yeah, they're cool. Medina Apartments, Mosque, obviously I just came from there. Do I want to go to the apartments? I don't have any particular reason to at the moment. I think I want to go to Tarsus. So, I want to get back to Arcology? From these false sense of self I was looking for the way back to the Arcology and I found this. Just a bunch of people getting a message from Her Holiness, but check out this. I can now pick these up because my strength is higher. And there's something up here. That is a strange, strangely vibrant image. Whoa. Where is this? What is this? I assume... I assume I'm... It said restricted, so I assume I shouldn't get in the view of the camera. Like, are they going to try to kill me? Uh... Maybe I just shouldn't be here. I think I'm just going to leave. No more congestion. No more fatigue. Use Vitatech Cure 11. You, ma'am. You look like a discriminating person. Someone who knows innovation when she sees it. Where are you going with this? Are you tired of breathers? Are you sick of the Plague 11 cough? Have you had it with dizzy spells? I want to tell you about an amazing new elixir. Oh no, I'm sorry, I really don't. Combining ancient herbal remedies with state-of-the-art nanopathology research, we have produced the first and only anti-plague 11 tonic. No. And infused- Yeah, that's fast- Today only- No thanks. You owe it to yourself and your family to purchase the only real plague 11 cure. Okay, let's go check out Tarsus. Yes, this is the Cairo branch of your old alma mater, curiously geared towards younger children rather than covert security. There might be some clues about Apostle Corps inside, but the doors won't open unless you have a visitation pass. Start with the Nasif greenhouse and Dr. Nasif's crooked uncle who runs it. Hmm, so I guess I have to do that to get a visitor's pass. No hacking. No, it's just key code required. Damn. is, but let's check it out. Oh, there you are, little buddy.
what this place is. But it's gotta have good stuff in it. It's so well protected. Hold on, what does that say? Guard. Oh, guard station. Hmm. Oh, this probably isn't. Yeah, I don't Hello, even. WTO citizens. This isn't a restricted Look zone about right here. You with the splendor of the WTO enclaves. You enjoy a higher standard of living than anyone else in the world. Know this: such prosperity is not a product of corruption, and I am injured by the accusations against my office in Cairo. Yeah. Okay. Sure. This is where all the rich white people get to live. The WTO handpicks cities for incorporation and citizens. Arcology air. Oh, elevator. I mean, do I really want to fuck with the guard station? Not really? Oh, that looks like the brig. This is the Arcology's outreach kiosk. Any trouble, you can report it to me. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing to do here. ATM. Six hundred bucks. I'm very lucky that they weren't looking at me when that happened. Whew. Corporate suites. Oh, do I need a key code or? Oh, yeah. Dang. So a lot of places that I just have to like get into after doing a quest or something. Arcology Air Terminal. So is this like for traveling to places? Like air travel? But I saw it in the news. All of Chicago gone. I know it's scary, but don't worry. They'll find the terrorists. Shit. And we're very safe here in the Arcology. They're making us do security drills at the Academy. I should get a colorist to check my lipstick. We're on guard now. We take extra precautions. And the SSC is out in full force. Daddy says the SSC couldn't fight their way out of a Medina playground. <sighs> yes, well, your father was just being a comedian. Oh, children. It's a tough time to be a parent now. I'm worried about the terrorists. I hope they can't get into the arcology. Who the hell are you? I made it clear to the Arcology chairman that NG would not arrive until tomorrow, and that regardless, there would be no solicitations, no endorsements, and no appearances until showtime. My mistake. Sorry. For a second I thought you were that guy who runs the Pequod's coffee shop downstairs. The fool thinks that if he attacks me with a goofy grin, I'll convince NG to endorse the franchise. You can't blame him for trying, I guess. He could have at least given me my coffee for free. You'd sell your influence for a cup of coffee? It would be a start. I'm so sick of these nobodies expecting me to do special favors for them and not even having a few credits to compensate me for my trouble. What about you? Are you just a fan or do you have a good reason for bothering me? You seem like an absolute prick. Um. Oh, it's like a <laughs> have them promote each one of them, whichever one of them I want. Well, I'm going to go with Queek, right? Because they work in Lower Seattle. I mean, obviously they work all over the place, not just Lower Seattle, but I'm most familiar with the person who runs the one in Lower Seattle. And I'd like to see them flourish, because they have a harder time down there. I'd put down some money to see NG promote Queequegs. Splendid. I'll put in a good word. Can I trust you? As much as you can trust anyone who takes bribes. Now leave me be. Let's make an effort not to be seen together. I didn't even know this is where the manager was. Got lucky with that. Secrets? Aha! I knew there'd be something behind the counter. There always is. That's not true at all. Remember, you are leasing from us. You must grant the WTO entry for investigation of our own hangars. The Templars restrict access to their facilities. Flight Bay 24 is not a public airport. 
As soon as you've filled out all the necessary paperwork, they'll be glad to give you a complete tour. I have done that three times already. This is ridiculous. It must have gotten lost in transit. There's no record here. Or perhaps you did not fill them out completely. As soon as they have your forms in order, they'll be happy to permit your investigation. Until then, there's nothing I can do. Is something wrong? Yes. I'm trying to get access to this hangar to see if it might explain these figures, and failing miserably. Whoever said the WTO has perfected bureaucracy has obviously never dealt with the Templars. What do you mean? The WTO is reviewing the Templars' duties and tariff payments, so they've dispatched me to do a proper audit. They may put on a show of amicability, but every time I try to actually see what's in that hangar, I get the runaround. What do you suspect is going on? I have no idea, but whatever it is, my figures suggest they're not paying nearly enough for transporting it via a WTO facility. Maybe you'd have better luck? A new face? If you get the info to us, we can make it worth your while. I'll see what I can do. Offering 200 credits? Come on, I'm not that cheap. I get three times that from hacking an ATM. Like this one right here. You don't have time for this. There, I just got 600 credits. Can I help you? Can I just take a peek at that hangar? <laughs> I'm sorry, but I Oh yeah, I'm sure that'll work. Thank you for your interest. Very effective. Hmm. Bay 23. Come on, I don't need this today. Restricted access. Ooh. Ooh. That's one of those gas things? Yeah, a gas release panel. So is this one not restricted? Yeah, this one isn't. Oh, they should be breakable. Sad. Aha. How many do I have? Six. Maintenance receipt. Uh, inspection, blah, blah, blah. You can read this if you want. Nothing too interesting. Six month license, fee waived. Guess at some point I'll be able to activate that to get out of this place. Repairing damage. Finished. Thank you. Some mines, not worth it. Definitely not worth two multi tools. Whoa. Anytime an explosive, uh, I was gonna say barrel, anytime an explosive box moves really fast, I get scared. There's gotta be something in here, you know? Like something else, like some pathway, but I guess not. Oh yeah, I totally forgot you can break these things. Unfortunately, I exploded the mines inside, not that I even wanted them in the first place, but yeah, that's a thing. Just a nice little recessed door-like place is not actually a door. Let's go back to that cordoned off place right here. So this isn't a secret place right here. 
There's the restricted hangar. Need to find info in there. But for now, let's stick to this. Weapon mod and info. Bay 24 safe combination. Oh, cool. Hmm. Maybe I should try to blow this up. I guess I'll just, like, throw a grenade at it? Nobody's running around. I think we did it. Yeah, cool. So what kind of weapon mod was that? Oh my god, it was another refire rate. Aha! Is that supposed to be like a whiteboard? Like the kind you write on with the dry erase marker things? Because if so, it looks like it's made out of shiny concrete, just like everything in this game is made out of concrete. Some of that might have to do with the high resolution texture pack, I don't actually know. Because I don't know what the original textures look like. Hopefully they didn't change the character of the textures, they just made them literally higher resolution. Hmm. So I was going to go inside of the restricted bay 24, however, you'd need a key code, you can't hack it. And there doesn't seem to be a way in. I double checked all the areas that I've been to around here and see if there's any hallways and stuff I haven't gone down. But no, it just seems like there is no way in other than here. So... Oh wow, there's a huge robot in there. Oh wow. Ah, oh, that's probably like a one-hit kill. So I'm thinking maybe in some other place there's a vent that maybe would take you down here. Or more likely, I need a quest that will give me the code. Or maybe if I go through, like, the executive suites or apartments or something, I'll find a key code for it or something. Well, I'm back out in Arcology. Hello, WTO citizens. There is actually this vent here. I doubt it's going to lead to another zone, you know? Like, all the way down to one of the hangars. In fact, where is that? That's going to hurt if I drop down. Hmm. Well, anyway, I think it's a pretty good place to end the episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I'm going to explore more of Arcology.